Hello. Welcome. Uh, we're going to get started in here in a few minutes if you haven't yet. Uh, the programs are actually on a PDF online. The QR codes, if you haven't got them, are out in the lobby, out in the uh, foyer and the hallway. So if you want to go snag that before we get started here, I'd invite you to do that. Uh, otherwise, hang tight. We'll get started soon. Can we get the mic just a little bit, a little bit higher? Miss Wolf, Miss Flanagan's coming to help you with that. Awesome. Awesome.
Welcome everyone. Thank you for coming in uh, or joining us on YouTube tonight to the 2022 ed edition of the annual Rouse High School Night of Percussion. Rouse High School Night of Percussion. Yeah. So most of the time percussion instruments are utilized as like the rhythmic glue or like the sprinkle on top to kind of make a, a music really pop. Uh, and in the band, we're in the back of the ensemble where they featured as like a fundamental part uh, of the rep repertoire. However, uh, music specifically written for percussion has established itself as its own uh, genre uh, here in the past century or so. And uh, we are lucky enough to have a band staff here that truly appreciates that. And they allow me and these kids a solid two months uh, to flex our rhythmic muscles uh, and prepare our very own concert. So it's really cool and we do not take that for granted at all. Uh, and I, I can tell you uh, that does not happen everywhere. Uh, so uh, that's very, very cool. And so we hope you enjoy that. So now you'll hear literally hundreds of techniques uh, demonstrated on a combination of over 50 different percussion instruments, many of which the students just learned how to play this semester. <laughs> um, this is what we love about being percussionists, and we're very excited to showcase that with you tonight. Our first group is the Wiley Beginner Percussion Section. Not much longer than about a half a year ago, these students could barely tap their feet and count at the same time. <laughs> Today, they'll demonstrate a wide range of musical skills that culminate in this challenging piece uh, performing Begin Transmission, please welcome the Wiley Beginner Percussion.
Okay, well, we can set up back there for our next ensemble. We're gonna feature a, a Wiley Middle School soloist. This is Simon King, and he'll be performing From the Cradle by Bart Portier. Please welcome Simon King. Okay, our, our next group to perform is a combined 7th and 8th grade symphonic and wind ensemble percussion classes from Wiley Middle School. Please welcome performing Final Boss, the symphonic band and wind ensemble percussion.
No, no, no. Okay, the next couple groups we have are pretty pretty special that are going to be performing in front of the curtain, so to speak, uh, while we get set up back there. This next group is a combined uh, effort between all three bands here at Rouse High School. Uh, there's percussionists from, from all over, so uh, we decided that we, we, we weren't quite done with the marching band yet, and we wanted to uh, keep, keep playing our, our rudiments. Uh, and so these group of students completely organized this on their own, wrote the music on their own uh, and came up with something pretty, pretty cool. So obviously I you know, helped guide them along the way, but uh, I think it's gonna be really cool. So uh, please welcome performing Swanky, the Rouse High School Snare Ensemble.
Okay, that was fun. <laughs> All right, so this next piece is, is kind of unique. We have a audio accompaniment along with acoustic performance. Uh, this one's uh, challenging in, in, in different ways in that uh, you'll see me here, here in a second plug into the uh, 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 sound interface and I'm getting a click in my ear and they just have to stay with me. So, uh, and everything else is, is all acoustic, uh, but please welcome uh, performing Disguise, the Rouse Symphonic Percussion.
All right. So likewise with this group, they were completely on their own. Uh, everything that you're gonna hear is, is stuff that they came up with and rehearsed on their own. Many, many days after school, they stayed, stayed out late. Uh, you know, and we have great band facilities here, uh, but unfortunately there's only like three or four different spaces we can really rehearse in. Uh, and all those spaces are claimed after school, pretty much every day after school of the week. So uh, these guys rehearsed in the hallways, outside, at, at parks, where, basically wherever they, they could uh, to, to pull this off. Uh, we had to borrow extra drums from Leander High School just to uh, accommodate for all those that were interested. So this is really, really cool, really special. Uh, in my time here, we haven't had a lot of, um, how do you say, dedicated uh, quad tenor players, uh, but these guys have really taken to the instrument and uh, done really cool, cool things with this. So please welcome performing Miso Soup, the quad, Rouse Quad Ensemble.
This next piece uh, is, is pretty special to me. It, it, it means a little bit to me on, on a, a couple different levels. Uh, as you know, band directors have many music friends in the field outside of teaching, and one of my good friends, Daniel Montoya Jr., uh, composed this piece, uh, and it's entitled Mayhem. So a, a little funny story to that. When, he, uh, when, their, when their first daughter was born, uh, they, named, they na named her Mara Mayhem. And uh, this piece is dedicated towards that, uh, that sort of chaos that ensues after uh, first delivering a baby that I have uh, gotten to experience firsthand uh, and well, all, <laughs> know all too well uh, the mayhem that that, that is uh, trying to raise a baby slash toddler. So um, this, uh, this was an exciting piece to put together. The kids are, uh, love it. It's a really, really cool piece. So you'll hear a lot of raucousness and uh, some some sweet moments as well in between, uh, but ultimately pretty much just mayhem. So uh, please welcome the uh, Win Ensemble Percussion Performing Mayhem.
yeah, there's definitely a section in there where it's like things are going peacefully and then boop, they're waking up in the middle of the night. So <laughs> rudely awakening. So that was fun. Uh, the next piece is as pretty unique. Normally you see uh, mostly keyboard solos, vibraphone, marimba, four mallets, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, I'm definitely out of breath after that, that one. Uh, this next piece is pretty interesting. Uh, it's a multi-percussion, uh, and our senior Sam Stoddard uh, wanted to really take interest into the hand drumming his uh, final semester here, and I was all about it. He came to me with this piece, and I was like, yes, let's do it. That's really, really cool. Uh, so please help me welcome performing Chatterbox, Mr. Samuel Stoddard. Thank you. 
Real quick before we get on to the next tune, can I have my beginner percussionist check their stick bags? Make sure you have your stick bag. Beginners slash middle schoolers. If you see a bunch of mallets in there that are not yours, please bring them up here. Thank you. All right. We found it, no problem. Okay, so uh, I really like to do large ensembles, uh, which includes multiple percussion classes, but uh, with the one that we picked this year, it actually presented a unique opportunity where we get to do uh, small quartets. So the next two ensembles you'll be hearing are from the Rouse Honor Percussion Quartets. And the first one is Escape Velocity. Please welcome Rouse Honor Percussion Quartet.
Next performer is a junior percussionist uh, reigning from Styles Middle School. Please welcome performing Blue Slide, Manisha Sahu. Looks like we're about ready. Please help me welcome uh, performing Fractalia, the other honor percussion quartet.
Our last soloist of the evening is by our senior brass percussion member, soon to be music major. Uh, this piece is a little different, and, and typically in solo marimba literature, you're used to seeing uh, four mallet percussion. It's actually two mallet piece, but it's highly virtuosic. Please welcome performing White Knuckle Stroll, Mr. Spencer Alger.
Before we begin our last piece, just want to depart you with some thank yous. First of all, thank you so much for coming out tonight and, and sharing this concert with us. Uh, thank you specifically to our parents, especially. Uh, without your help, support, you know, private lessons, rides, organizing them, telling them, remember, you got to be here at this time. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, this, this does not come together without you, so, without you. So thank you so much to our parents. I'd like to thank uh, some of the school staff. Uh, the administration, our principal, Dr. Tom, Tanya Thompson, our AP over, over fine arts, uh, Ms. Dollar Smith, and the fine arts department chair, Ms. Chrissy Flanagan. Uh, I would like to also thank my fellow directors, Mr. Ryan Johnstone, Ms. Caitlin Wolf, and Mr. Matt Wood. They have been so, so supportive of everything that we do here as, in the percussion program, like I mentioned earlier tonight. Uh, without their uh, support and, and giving them giving us their time uh, during classes and after school. Uh, again, none of this is possible, and we get to really, really get into the nitty gritty with uh, a lot of really cool percussion literature and rep uh, that we frankly just don't get to experience on the same level with band literature. So, so, so thank you so much, band directors. Also, special thank you to, uh, oh, excuse me, <laughs> our other band directors, not just at Rouse High School, but at uh, Wiley Middle School as well, Mr. Taylor Williamson, Ms. Uh, Christina Barrera and Ms. Becky Click. So thank you to the directors. Thank you so much. <laughs> also to our private lesson staff, they spend a lot of one-on-one -on -one time in helping each individual student with their particular needs and goals. Every single student uh, is, is in a different place, frankly, and uh, they have done such an amazing job. I, I would bet we have probably one of the best percussion private lesson staff in, in Central Texas. It's, it's really incredible the work they do, uh, and I'm so appreciative of them to Mr. Clayton Straub and Mr. Kevin Zatina, so thank you to those two. Thank you also to the students uh, for not only putting up with me, but also my amazing dad jokes on, on, a, on a daily basis. Um, they outpun me sometimes, so. Uh, but no, really, thank you for, for letting me demand the most of you and setting high expectations and, and, uh, and you also meeting me halfway and, and practicing all, all day and all night and, and making this percussion concert and your band programs really, really special. So thank you, students. And last, and last and of course not least to my family and specifically to my wife who uh, allows me to do this crazy thing called band directing where we spend a lot of time before or after school uh, and, and all the craziness that is uh, band directing in the fall and the spring. Um, I love you so much. Thank you, Anna. Parents, just a last reminder, after, after we finish this piece, we're asking the students to uh, help us take all this equipment back to the band hall and put it up, making it look nice and neat uh, so we can come back to a clean space on Tuesday. So without further ado, this is a combined percussion ensemble with Rouse Honor and Win Ensemble Percussionists performing Beyond the Clouds. Thank you so much. Thank you. 
Thank you so much. Have a great night. Drive safe.